Okay, Akumaldo Crypto here, guys, with another Bitcoin update. Sorry, yesterday we had a, a per, I, I don't know, someone is building something here in my building. It was a lot of noise. I couldn't simply record it. Okay, but actually, Bitcoin is doing its sideways movement, as I said, that would happen. Uh, on uh, Friday update okay so um, our, this is the daily chart we are yes doing as I I said this is our ABC okay nothing has happened that that invalidate this count so I am con I am really convinced that this is the count in play uh, actually, I would put this wave tree here a bit deeper. Um, four, like here, wave five, I don't know. The, the, actually, this thing here is like impossible to predict. Okay, we need to focus on on the short term because this is a this is a hypothesis. Okay, even though we have the Elliott wave principle behind us, if we are using this this tool. Um, it's difficult markets dynamic systems guys uh, how to deal with unpredictability <laughs> how to deal with that huh we think that our lives is so predictable but it's not okay it's not you say you tell me oh, oh I don't like Elliott waves because uh, you don't talk about certainties yes of course not <laughs> what TA are you following because if, if they are talking about certainties they are fooling you okay they're fooling you because we need to talk about probabilities okay, this is all about statistics how likely it is that this is going to go down here we get a lot of uh, pieces of data a lot of information together to give us confidence that there is this is the place that Bitcoin is gonna land the it, it, it's what we do but as always I present different scenarios that's good that's uh, it's might as well be the, the the direction okay like this blue line here guys okay I said this blue line here might uh, contain the whole movement Remember, I said that we might have an A, uh, A, B, C, D, E. Okay, we might have an, uh, a, a triangle here. Oh, it, what about this? This is a throw, uh, a throw out. Okay, it's 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 okay. Okay, it's a, uh, or you can say uh, <clears throat> this is a, a bear trap. Okay. Um. So it's it's difficult to say. Oh, this is definitely a wave two. It's probable. It's likely to be a wave two here. It's likely to get to those levels that I marked here, six, six seven hundred, six nine hundred at uh, the max here, or perhaps touch the the yellow line here. We never know. Okay, we never know. Okay, <clears throat> definitely, um, it's difficult. It's just to say something with a lot of confidence in this market or in any market. Okay, let me let me see the the EMA. Okay, um, this is the eighth, the thirteenth. This one I would like to give it a different color. Yes, let's see. Um, I'm gonna take a close look here yes so guys we have a lot of crosses here okay it crossed pretty much everything okay this the 200 GMA is here touching the yellow line the 100 GMA is here exactly touching the the target for a wave 2 here for the max wave 2 yes I think it's gonna descend here it's gonna probably cross here okay and then we have the 55 ma for my second target here you see here the red line and then we have this huge cross here the 21 ma now is acting as a resistance you see 
resistance, it touch it. Okay, then we have this doji. It's a doji uh, spinning top. And then we tried again, rejection. Now we tried the, the, remember the blue line here? We tried and we bounced, okay? And uh, the, the green line here is the EMA 8th, is acting as a support. And now we are testing the 13 EMA. This is the orange one here. Daily, okay guys, daily. Um, it's fine, it's fine, everything is fine. Actually, <coughs> oh my goodness, sorry. Uh, everything is fine according to <laughs> if you like bear markets because that's what we are now in a bear market not now for a lot of time i think for i, I have been calling this bear market since the beginning of the year guys it was clear that we would need this kind of correction because of the amount of time that we need to correct okay when we have such a poignant correction in price like this I have I have discussed this in detail in previous videos um, so let's take a look at the weekly chart because it's it's been a while that I don't do so uh, this is the weekly yes <clears throat> you see okay nothing much uh, let me give you the um, yes, we are. We tried again to to break this blue line. Remember this this trend blue line here is a, a, an amazing support. It has been tested a lot in the weekly chart. Okay, <clears throat> not a lot of market acceptance here, guys. So if it goes here, it's easy to break through it, right? Oh, see here, not a lot of market support. Yes, it's difficult. Definitely, it's difficult. If Bitcoin touches the the 100 DMA, see this yellow line here. This is the 100 DMA. If Bitcoin touches the yellow line here, it's gonna be the first time that Bitcoin ever touches the uh, the, the 100 DMA in the weekly chart. Okay, first time ever. And by the way, I think we had a cross here. No, we, we haven't. What, what is this? No, no, sorry. Not a cross. But let me see one thing here. <clears throat> this is the eighth. Let's take a look at... What is it? Yes, we are below it as well. Below. Below about... Below the eighth EMA. So... If we touch it, it's gonna be six to seven hundred. Yeah, it's my target. So you see a lot of uh, pieces of uh, confluences, right? Uh, one more data showing us that this target is possible. We would touch it, six to seven hundred, and we would get down. Okay, this is the eighth, <clears throat> um, the green one. You can actually. This is those are the values that I use. Okay, pretty basic. Um, yeah. Uh, this one, yes, everything. This one would be. This one is the thirteen. This is only the twenty-one. No, this one is not the twenty-one. Wait. Yes, twenty-one. <laughs> Sorry, guys. And uh, the the. the we touch it, we, we try as yes, this was the, yeah, we tried it, it, but we have this huge, huge bearish candle here, come on, yes, um, so we have this confluence here, 6, 7, the 8th EMA, and we have this 21 EMA pointing to 7K, okay, if we go to those levels here. Why I'm talking about it? Because when we when we take a look at the daily, oh, I'm sorry, one hour chart. I'm gonna zoom this thing. Okay. Let me zoom this thing because friends complained that the screen was not optimal um, to view in cell phones. So let me make it bigger. 
So when we look at the hourly chart, we see a lot of resistance here. here. Um, uh, all those resistance are based on Fib Fibonacci levels, okay? Confluences, okay? I'm, I'm not gonna show you guys how to, to create those resistance. Perhaps I'm gonna, if you, if you take a look at my videos, you're gonna pretty much understand it because I go over it uh, not explain exactly how I do it, but if you look at the, the fibs, you're gonna understand why I'm m marking it as a support and everything. Okay, so this is the whole correction for this wave one. Okay, we have a W X Y the way I'm marking it, and then we would finish this wave two. This wave one here is this wave one here. Okay, this two here is this one here. This two here, so it would go the uh, one here two and then three going down so we are we finished x we are going now up to put an a b c okay oh such a long a if you you would argue with me huh? yes it's a, it is such a long a we haven't finished a the way i'm seeing it we are going sideways and we are now in a wave four if you followed me on, uh, if you have been watching my videos on Friday, I said that this would be a sideways correction because we had such a, a dramatic poignant uh, correction for a wave A that we traced 50%. When we have it, we probably, we, we, we it's likely that we are going to correct in time. That's what's happening. We are correcting time. We are correcting sideways. Okay, This huge week here. It's something that we need to accept, but I won't accept within the edit wave. I would need to invalidate this 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 triangle here, this barrier. <clears throat> I'm sorry, <clears throat> because wave C cannot go deeper than wave A. It cannot break the price and it break, but it has break. But it, it's a weak. It's uh, what happens next. Okay, let, let me explain you guys. First of all, it hasn't it it hadn't break this channel. It I'm sorry. It hasn't broken this channel. Yes? No. Uh it has touched the 618. Nice. And reaction. So I'm going to continue. I'm going to insist in this count here because it's really the, 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 the formation here is clear enough that we are going to have a D, probably an E here, and then we are going to go up. Perhaps a breakout out of this D. Okay? Perhaps. So, but 618 is not a bad target for a wave 4. It's okay. Um, and the... Uh, we, if we... If, if I am to consider a different count here, it would be a W, X, and a Y here. And it would have an A, B, C. Hmm. It's a con it, it, it is possible. Okay? It is possible. If we are... Uh, this is a, would be a W, X, and Y. Hmm. Uh, I'm not going to short it now. <clears throat> I need, uh, so, b pay attention at this movement here. If we see that if it, if it breaks this line here again then it's definitely an uh, a w here and but afterwards we are gonna go up okay it would be a a deeper wave four that might that remember that uh, must not invade this region here okay this region here is the wave one it cannot uh, go beyond the level of wave one here except for a week okay if you have a week here going crossing here it's okay but if you had a candle here i would invalidate this count and <clears throat> it would uh, break this channel that would be a sign that this count here is not correct it, it would invalidate my count okay uh that's pretty much for you for my 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 update isn't it uh, let, let's just we have those all targets here minus 33 60 percent 
Minus 38, 20%. What is bugging me a bit? It's that this wave A here is getting really long. Let's measure, okay? I'm gonna... Ex okay, let's imagine that we get to the sixth... 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 Uh, okay. Six, seven hundred. Let's imagine it, okay? Almost it. Then we have a B that is really deep. I don't know. That doesn't break, perhaps. That test the 2360% here. Yes, it's not impossible. 100% for our wave 2. It would go to the target, okay? This resistance here, you guys can see. Exactly at the 618, 65%. This would be our wave 2 here. This would be our target. Uh, okay, this is the FIB extension, guys. Okay, this is a hypothetical way. We don't have this data, guys. I am. I don't know where this wave, this fifth wave is going to end. I don't know. In my end, it might be a longer wave 5. Okay, it might. And then we would have a wave B. I don't know where it's gonna land as well. Uh, it might break this channel, it's probable. Let's measure it. Uh, if we have this wave A here, this is the beginning of wave A here down in the, this week here. This would be our hypothetical end of A A. Oh, exactly what I said, see? This is where we would have a wave B. Yes, so, yes, that, 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 that's pretty much this region here, see, it's, that, that's how I, I draw supports and resistance, guys, this one here, I would mark, if we get here, I would mark this one as a support, okay, because we have a confluence here, then, yes, we, we might get this, this as a B, would break the channel and then it would go up 100% it would be here this region here okay minus 33 20. you see and then we have the elbow targets here for this movement minus 33 60 percent minus 38 20 percent so confluence nice confluence here okay for this wave c but this is for the future guys this is not for now this is just this is a forecast okay and this is hypothetical because we don't have the data we don't have the, oh sorry we don't have the data to really this a here has not finished not nor this b so this c here i i'm assuming that this is gonna land to those regions here this region here minus root to six percent okay then we are gonna go down and then i can use my fib extension to derive uh, a target for wave c okay um i hope you guys enjoy it uh, that's enough for this sunday morning <laughs> uh thanks for watching if you haven't followed me on twitter please consider doing so uh, a lot of updates there and uh, join us in our Crypto Trader in Educational Institute. It's totally free. It's, uh, we have uh, a lot of good analysts there. I would I wouldn't be I would be nothing without them. <laughs> um, and like and subscribe, guys. And oh yes, and you have my Patreon if you want to throw me a bit. <laughs> if you want to throw me some coins, not actually throw. Uh, you got you guys understood yeah? <laughs> thank you very much guys uh, have a wonderful weekend bye bye cheers see you guys tomorrow <laughs>